Hey guys, what's going on today? This is your friend Dal Su. Dal Su plays, and we're back with a little bit more civilization. Alright, just double checking my software, making sure everything works. You know, we keep it casual here. And I'm about to maybe attack Kiev. If only I had like three spearmen, or two swordsmen and two spearmen. That's probably what I'm gonna get. It's two swordsmen and two spearmen. It's gonna take a long time. But I'm glad to have these guys kind of set up. I'm just going to fortify them. It is going to freak Venice out, obviously. But that's okay. Why are you still embarked, you fool? Let's embark. Soul has grown again. It's working all these crappy tiles, and we're just rushing faster than we can fix them up, you know. It's also They also grabbed this one. We could use a, a sawmill there. All right, let's go ahead and end our turn. We're pretty close to being ready, but some things are holding us back a little bit. I wonder what would happen if all four of these guys is headed towards me right now. I mean, I could fend them off, I guess. 23 is pretty good. Better than our capital. I guess he needs to be there. I'm just worried about losing Jonju if I attack. Would you be interested in Let's check the info addict. Mm, what am I looking for? Military manpower, right? So Venice has 60, and I'm at 42. Venice actually hasn't grown in a while. I would be ready to attack him if I just had some kind of good ground units that could go in and scoop the city more easily. Sidon and Venice now allies? That's even fucking worse. How do you keep grabbing my allies? Well, they're going to come down to Busan and try to take me over. And I don't even have a unit in Busan, so we need, uh, at the very least, composite bowmen there. I'm going to move that to more important than the horsemen. Barbarian encampment over there. Quebec City should give me a quest for it before too long. Of course, they love Songhai. Everybody wants to, me to bully people. I'm not that kind of guy. Oh, okay. We already got a quest from Ormus. So, we can't really spare too many units right now. I guess we could send this little guy over there to start dealing with him. We just finished a caravan. We might as well so close to getting that iron, but two turns. Alright, Soul, why don't you spit out a quick Spearman. Can you do that? Spit out a quick Spearman. This caravan, where are you going? Um, I want somewhere kind of safe. Where is Jean? Jin? Jin? All the way over there. I mean, it's a little bit dangerous, but I think we can risk it for the seven gold to science. We're going to get some religious pressure, but that's not a big deal. You're going to fortify up there, help protect Jonju. I, actually, we'd probably want to switch these out, wouldn't we? Make more sense. I'm just a little bit afraid for, for Jonju if I do go through with this attack. A little bit scared for Jonju. Alright, why don't you fix up this one? And you're gonna fortify on that hill, that sounds fine. What did I just get? I just got engineering, right? Okay, good deal. Let's get currency too. Uh, we could head for our Huachas. I really want those Huachas, but we're not gonna have the money to upgrade unless we get currency, so let's get currency. I'm going to go ahead and refuse you there. I'm about to attack you. Yes, yeah, he's got some units, but I believe Jonju should be able to take them. Alright. Do we get the iron yet? We got the iron, so... I'm going to tell you, after those spearmen, we're going to do two swordsmen, and then we're going to go to town in ten turns. That's going to take him a few turns to set up as well, but... 
we'll be able to handle it, I think. Yeah, farm there. Alright, you got that taken care of. Good. We could do this other salt. That's going to leave us pretty well extended when the battle kicks off. So I'll probably move the salt to here for right now. Fix that sheep up. That way he's kind of in the back, you know. Alright, we got the spearmen. Fight on rough terrain, I guess. We'll put him kind of in the front lines. And we got a barracks here. I'm going to want maybe another composite bowman, maybe, for defense. We'll get a spearman. Busan has grown. Excellent. Where did you grow to? You decided to go here. All right. My golden age, unfortunately, ended, as all things must. I'd love to go take out this city, but, I mean, this barbarian camp for Ormus. Jeez. <laughs> Mongolia attacking Ormus? What are you doing, Mongolia? You fucking bastards. Man, I do need to gift them a unit, don't I? Um, but am I willing to part with any of my units? Probably not, dude. I mean, that sucks that Mongolia is attacking you. I do not want them to have a city right there, and I do not want to lose my fucking ally. So, I guess maybe I have to. Um, this sucks. Hardcore, but I will gift it. Okay? You happy now? Please do not lose. <laughs> Please do not lose. Alright, these spearmen are coming up to these spearmen. I just gave you a unit. Serious? Alright, well they should be okay. But I need a new composite bowman. Um, is this a hill? It actually is. So, yeah, give me a mine. And give me a sheep paddock. We're about ready. Just a little nervous. I guess I'll probably go after just the one... The one swordsman. Who's got to upgrade? Nobody, okay. We should be able to win this. We should be able to win it. What do we just research? I'm getting to the point where I'm clicking too fast now. I gotta slow things down. Okay. I really want metal casting. Because it gives you a forge and a workshop. Guilds and civil service are both excellent techs. Uh, but this one leads to my sweet Huachas, so I'm probably going to go ahead and get that. Even though, I'm not really going to be able to afford those Huachas. Not the upgrades, anyway. Alright, I'm pretty close to being ready. This guy's actually in range of the Bombard, though. I'd like to switch that out. Yeah, okay. Now only the Spearman's in range. a little scary. We don't have enough ground units. I really don't think we do. Why did he move there? I didn't tell you to move there. I did not tell you to move there. Why did you do that? Oh, I know what happened. His borders grew. Ah, I see.
All right, fine. We got a new bowman, but he's got to stay there because Sidon's liable to come down and try to fuck with us. How are we doing now? Let's let's see how we're doing. 63 to 43, so not that far off, really. I think I'm about ready. I do want that Spearman, though. Going too fast. I gotta slow this down. Alright. So, again, Kiev's on rough terrain, I believe, so we're gonna do rough terrain. We're gonna head you in, like... like you to be about right here. So that you can press this hill. Why don't you go right there and then talk to me? Alright. I don't have any archers now. Because I gave my stupid archer to these guys. Venice! You son of a bitch! They got Cape Town too? Really? Okay, I got my first spy. That's nice. Renaissance era. Alright, so... I'm not like 100% sure how this all works and everything, but... I think what I've watched most people do is they'll check Info Addict and see... Who has the most technologies, and this is England. Wow. They're only three ahead of us, but... They are ahead of us. So... I might piss them off if I send my guy to London, but I'm not worried about pissing off Venice, because I am about to attack them after all. So, I could also use my spy to try to get one of these city-states to flip. Don't like Venice having me surrounded by their fucking city-state allies. Um, I'll probably go ahead and move him to Venice. And I'm going to read this. It's been a long time since I've read this. If war is declared, your spy will escape the city. The diplomat will not attempt to steal technology from the other player, but will still provide intrigue. Once the World Congress convenes, you'll determine their opinion on proposals, blah, blah, blah. We're going to do a spy, but I think... Uh, yeah, okay, he's going to go to Venice. I, I don't know. He's, he's going to escape once war is declared, right? That's kind of a waste, then. Soul has grown yet again. And it just keeps gobbling up tiles faster than I can fix them, man. Crazy. Alright. We about ready? I wish I had more... units. <laughs> Let's wait. Maybe we shouldn't wait. Damn it! All right, so we're not uh, we're not close enough to the Renaissance era to justify trying to hold on to this ring thing. So we'll probably just do production in every city, five percent product. Actually, we can't. All it does is provide one culture in every city. That's, you know, I'm not going to take any of these other things. I could have taken maybe Exploration, but eh. Still not ready, huh? I mean, I actually am ready. Let's do it. Let's fucking do it. Saluti. Just their city states scare the hell out of me, man. This damn city states. So I gotta fight Sophia. Sidon is gonna come down and attack me. Those are the only two that really matter. Cape Town is not really relevant, and Singapore is not really relevant. All right. 
I'd like to go ahead and thrash these pikemen as best I can. You can move right here. Then I'm in range of the city bombardment, so I'll go ahead and set him up right there. I'll probably move him later, but... These guys, will they be able to shoot? Not after that move, huh? Alright, that's fine. We just got uh, some swordsmen there, huh? I guess... Who gave us those swordsmen? I'm not going to complain. Soul can actually shoot this missionary, so we'll do that. These swordsmen are going to come down as fast as they can. These guys are going to... Can you bombard those spearmen, please? And we're just going to have to kind of hold the fort against whoever comes. That's pretty good damage. Garrison unit bonus makes a huge difference. We'll do that, and then we'll shoot them. And then their warriors are not really scary anymore. I'm probably going to tuck these guys in a little bit. Although I am worried that they might come after my iron, so maybe I will leave them there. Any po enemy pikemen attacked my catapults. Shit. They attacked it twice? Oh no, the city-state destroyed it. Well, oh, god damn it. Alright, well, off to a pretty shitty start, but we'll see what we can do. Alright, so they're bringing a spearman in. That shouldn't be too much of a problem. Should be able to deal with this. Yeah, okay. Alright, that's fine. I am going to bombard these guys. And of course, I'm going to need to do something about this. They're tearing up my catapults. I guess I'm not as prepared as I would have thought. This guy can't actually do anything. He stay there. Why is it... Let me look at this. It's because he's a pikeman. He has such stronger strength, right? I get a flanking bonus and a rough terrain attack bonus. But they get a much bigger bonus. Um, this seems like a pretty good move. We'll do that. I need these archers to be closer. We're going to get another archer over here, I think. These guys are going to fight on rough terrain, and I'm right there. These swordsmen need to hurry the hell up. Ah, damn it! I'm going too fast. Slow the shit down. An enemy pikeman damaged my horsemen. Shit. Certainly did. That's a lot of units. But I don't think I need to be scared, except for these guys need to run the fuck away, for sure. These guys need to be bombarded. These guys need to be tucked in. We might lose the iron, but we've already got two swordsmen, I think, so... I'm going to go here and just do my best to protect these guys. Do a sawmill. Yeah, i got to slow this way down. I'm moving way too fast. If I climb up on this hill, I'm going to start getting bombarded. We'll wait until the swordsman catches up. So, is that what we want to do, or... Yeah, let's do that. Maybe our bowmen can finish him off. Not quite, but our spearmen should be able to. Okay. Alright, and... 
we hit you? Yes, we can. You can't really do anything. Yeah, we're gonna move all. We're gonna move this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy here. Uh, so that means the catapult should be in a different spot. All next turn. What unit was killed? God damn it! Got metal casting. He moved in here. He killed my damn horsey bastard. We're starving over here in Jonju because of all their bullshit. That would be a defeat. Well, we do more damage to these guys, so let's do it. Okay. We finish them off? Yep. Okay. You guys fortify up until healed. We're doing okay over there. You guys can... Are we ready to move in? I think we are. Let's get a last bombard on that guy. Oh, shit. He's too close. He's too close. I'm gonna move you here. You guys are gonna come. Well, you can finish this guy off, right? Then you can't move. Okay, well, fine. I'm gonna move you here. You're in range now. We don't wanna move here because it's not a hill. We're gonna move you into there. Move you there. A little bit aggressive, but shit. This guy, if he's here, he can't attack, but he can do it from here. Okay. And we'll move you here. And you're gonna go here. Alright. Pretty confident we'll be able to take this city and then peace out, but you never know what's gonna happen when you're up against the immortal AI. We're gonna run a little long on this video because I want to get this shit taken out. Alright. Um, we did metal casting and we're ready to get physics now for our Huachas, so let's do that. Soul is ready for new construction. I say another catapult, probably. And we're going to give this guy a rough terrain bonus and ship him to the front as soon as possible. You're going to do me a lumber mill. Can't believe that guy killed my horse. Don't you, I know you're starving. Just hang in there, buddy. Hello again. I'm going to share Intrigue, I think. I want her to like me, and I want her to hate Venice. But how's he doing? He's gathering intelligence. He'll be able to steal technology in nine turns. Alright then, he's got good potential and everything. Um... I mean, go ahead and clear the marsh while you're here. Oh, no, you're going to get killed. Damn it! Ah, oh, damn, 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 damn. Slow down. Oh, he didn't kill it after all. Pikeman attacked your spearmen. Warrior attacked your spearmen. You're, I was bombarded by an enemy city over here. Okay. So, I guess we're looking pretty good. We're looking okay. We're going to be able to start this process now. Um, we move him out to a safe distance to heal. Yes, we will. We're going to fortify these guys, of course. And we're going to put you guys up on this hill. You guys. Let's see. We won't be able to do much good with you. I'm actually going to just probably shoot those archers before I do anything else. I mean, those pikemen. I'm going to bring this horsey down to here. Gonju, you're gonna defend yourself as best you can. You need to retreat or you're about to get killed. Up onto this hill. And should I just tell him to upgrade or should I heal him instantly? I'm gonna heal him instantly. It sucks really bad. No, I'm gonna give him a plus combat in rough terrain and I'm gonna fortify him. Alright, you head towards the front. 
I'm going to try to take out um, the only people who can threaten this guy are these warriors. And they're also threatening my... Oh, we killed them. Okay. Good deal. Alright, the next people who could possibly threaten these guys are probably these warriors. Oh, yeah. Alright, it's going well. We're going to end the episode. I'll be right back with another one tomorrow, and you can see me probably be able to take over this city. Thanks for watching. Bye.